is sponsored by the Orchid Supply Store. It is literally your one-stop shop for anything and everything you could possibly need orchid related. And they even sell orchids. Use my name code Hillbilly in the code section for a 12% viewers discount. So go check them out y'all. Hey y'all, it is Paula with Hillbilly Orchids. Welcome back to my channel. I hope everybody's having a fantastic day. I am just got done watering and um, received a package from Dear Sweet, and I'm on the rolly table, sorry. <laughs> um, I received a package from Dear Sweet uh, Carrie Hamilton, bless her little heart. She messaged me and she wanted to send me a 1K uh, present and um, I just thought that was so sweet and I really appreciated it um, you know just just the people in this orchid community they're really really great people you guys really really sweethearts um, you know Michael sent me a gift um, Carrie has sent me a gift you know just you know just not necessary but just so sweet you know what I mean just you can't <laughs> you can't um, you can't understand how priceless the friendships I have, have gained from this Orchid channel. Um, like, you know, we talk all the time. You know, me and Carrie talk all the time. Me and Michael talk all the time. And sometimes not always about Orchid stuff, which is, you know, we just talk about life stuff. Um, and, you know, like, they're just, because they're good friends. That's, that's just the bottom line. Uh, really good people really really good people so but I wanted to uh, go ahead and get this box opened um, Carrie honey sweetheart you did not have to do that but I I extremely appreciate it I really do you know I love my orchids so I'm excited I have no clue I have no no clue at all she actually just won uh, she was the fourth place winner in my giveaway. <laughs> that does seem kind of funny now. I think about it like, oh, gee, she sent me a present. So, no, I swear I didn't let her win, you guys. <laughs> Alright. Aloha, Paula. This did come from Hawaii. So, she, um, she ordered it from Mahalo. For support. Oh. Aloha Hawaii Orchids. Very nice. And it must be a Catlea type because it has a Catlea um, information sheet, which is nice. Tells you all the tells you all the stuff, uh, all the care, fertilizer, how to fertilize, and everything from the American Orchid Society. So that is nice, especially when you don't, um, when you're new to orchids, that is really nice. All right, we have, I thought I heard, yep, gravel or gravel, no, uh, bark did come out in there because I was, I kept hearing something rattling and I was like, whoops, I caught on the thing. Um. I kept hearing something rattling, and I was like, uh, I normally I can, I, understand, I know what bark sounds like, <laughs> but this time I didn't. I wasn't aware it was really bark. So, I see BLC. Whoop, oh, I'm sorry, I dropped it. <laughs> I dropped it. Alright, she is definitely coming out of the pot. Copper Queen. <laughs> oh my goodness, girl. Yep, we was talking about the Copper Queens. Um, and the fact that uh, definitely <sighs> there's differences in some of the Copper Queens. So, uh, she has a nice new little growth. Nice growth right there. Nice, nice, nice. Awesome. Thank you, honey. I appreciate that. I really do. That's a nice little ceiling. Got nice little roots. Definitely looks good. But yes, we were talking about the Copper Queen because, yep, 
um, they they're just they're they're coming up different. Um, they have different. Um, you know, like if they, depending upon where the Richard Mueller name falls, but when they do them seedlings too, the seedlings come out so different. So you just kind of don't know what exactly you're going to get. So you always have to kind of watch and go with that and see what happens. Um, you know, like I said, I do, I really like the ones that's got um, a real ruby lip, but as well as with most Cattleyas, if you'll notice, and like Francis Fox here is another one that's a good example. In the, oh sorry, in the um, when she's closer to the light, she will be redder, and if you bring her back away from the light, she's more orange. So it does light does affect how the colors is going to come out. So yeah. So I do believe that even with any of the Copper Queens, um, you know, because like I said, the one I got from Yoshi did have um, the uh, Toshi, Toshi, what is it? I'll put it up on the screen. It had it first, and then Richard Mueller last. And Michael made the suggestion, he's like, it needs the Copper Queen, true Copper Queen is supposed to be um, Richard Mueller first. I do believe. I'll have to... I'll have to put it right on the screen because now I can't remember. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> uh, but yeah, one way, one of the ways is supposed to be a, a the Copper Queen. But depending upon which parent they use as a seed pa uh, parent and a pollen parent, you know, just depends because you could do the, you know, you could do the cross either way. So, but yeah, there's been some, been a little bit of controversy about the copper queen <laughs> amongst the, quite a few of us um like i said we we were kind of a few of us are kind of sure that the one that we just got from yoshi is not copper queen so um we're not the true copper queen now these might be you know uh looking more like richard mueller because they are smaller and i want the bigger you know that's that's what i'd like to have is the bigger um the bigger uh, floofier type so yeah I want it to take more after the uh, Toshioki or what however you say it Tosh like I said I'll put it on the screen because I'm no good at remembering how to say that name so but thank you sweetheart I really do appreciate that I'm going to give her a nice drink of water since it's water and day and um she definitely I'm sure would like a nice drink but I appreciate that, honey. Thank you, thank you very much. And with that said, I appreciate each and every one of you beautiful, wonderful people stopping by and hanging out with me. And bye for now, y'all, till we meet again.